Well, hello, hello, my sweet dolls. This is Candy Doll, and welcome back to my sweet dolly little world. Thank you, thank you, thank you all so very much for being here and rocking with me. Please don't forget to thumbs up this video and all my other videos. Don't forget to see my whole list of dolly unboxings and all those good things like that. And as I said, thumbs up, subscribe, because you know that's totally important. And turn your notification bells on so you'll be notified whenever I upload a sweet dolly little video. Okay, so I've got a new dolly and I'm so incredibly excited. As soon as I saw that they were selling him on Amazon, I'm like, you know what? I don't care how long I have to wait. I'm getting him and he's finally here. It is LOL OMG guys, Prince B. Oh my God, how incredibly cute. Finally, a black boy doll for omg so cool look at that hair she's even excited because i decided i'm gonna make them brother and sister they are very similar in looks skin color hair color all that i think they would make an awesome brother and sister and she's so happy that's why she is here so yeah here he is in his artwork his box of course it's always just a little bit different he does not have earrings on, but he does have ear holes, as you see there. And in the artwork here, he is wearing two pairs of earrings. He has a super cute, awesome 19, is it late 80s, early 90s flat top haircut. Super cute. Look at how freaking cute he is. Oh my God, I'm so excited. So yeah, in his black and gold outfit, Prince B is ready to come out the box. There's a picture of his little brother. Hey, bro. He's really cute too. I don't know a lot about the little the little brothers and all that, little sisters and all that, um, but they're still cute. And here is the back of the box. As you can see here, 20 surprises. Awesome, cute outfit. I'm loving his little Timberlands there. And yeah, of course, you know, got the open box so that we can just see him straight off the bat he came from amazon let's see if there's any flaws or anything like that because you know we got to see that i think okay i think he looks okay i'm not the best at detecting little flaws and stuff like that if it was like a major flaw you know then we'd have a problem but you know i'm quite sure there's like little flaws every now and then but usually i don't want to be bothered with sending him back unless it's something that's a major 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 crazy thing if it had wonky eyes or something like that but he looks pretty good he's got the brown eyes as we see there just like his little sis not little sis just like his sister over here with her dark brown eyes so happy i got him i don't have any of the um ll boys i know they had um cool lev which i was on the fence about getting cool lev simply because because i like the fact that he had kind of like that like a uh, tannish skin and he looks Hispanic to me, but I don't like Cool Lev's hair at all. But I was thinking about maybe doing some reflocking on Cool Lev's hair. So I'm noticing that Amazon has got Cool Lev on sale for like $11 and change lately. I'm just waiting till it drops just a tad bit more. <laughs> but, you know, I will probably end up getting Cool Lev if I see it just slightly cheaper. I mean, how much cheaper do I want it to be? <laughs> but I definitely will end up getting him. I definitely wasn't going to pay the full price at the time he was out being that i'm so i just really didn't like his hair but cheap enough i will buy him and then redo his hair put some gold not gold um like blonde flocking on it so i think that was awesome this guy on the other hand i'm loving his hair just the way it is the hair color and all let me get him out of the box because it is time to break him out of his plastic prison all righty <laughs> Okay, guys, I have gotten Prince B out of his box without destroying it too much because I normally do that. But here is his box here. It has like, I guess this is supposed to be his room or his studio or whatever you call it. Let me kind of tear this off here. and see this little cardboard piece here. Let me pull the camera out a little bit. And you have this here, this cardboard piece. I guess that's his chair. He's got a basketball. I guess a music trophy. He's all his little sneakers there. So there's that cardboard piece there. Um, and then we have just here's the rest of the box. Nothing special. It's supposed to be like a picture of a little lamp. Oopsie. A lamp up there on the top. 
And then the bottom is like supposed to be like a big old sneaker. I guess a, ru a rug of a sneaker. <laughs> so there you go. That's it for all that. And here are his accessories. His stand is black with little gold specks in it, which I think is really cool. Let me show you this up close. Look at the gold specks since he's wearing black and um, gold. So, And it has the studs on it, which is really cool. You know, I wish OMG would do, like, clear stands. I don't know if there's ever been any clear stands. But I think it would be so much, like, cooler if they had clear stands so it could just match, you know, you know, depending on where you put your your dolls or whatever. So I'm having trouble sticking this in here. But, okay, that's that. And we have a brush, a gold brush. I prefer the combs more, but they sent a brush. And I don't even see why you would comb his hair because it's like textured. So it's supposed to stay textured like that. Here is this little book right there. Here is a little leaflet thingy or whatever you want to call it. I don't really care to read those. Here is his clip. I guess they come with two clips. Let's see. I think I had another one. It might have fallen. But, you know, since he's a boy, they would have a, it would have a bigger clip. Um, and here is his little magazine, and he is a Gemini. Your future is as bright as your bling. So that's cute. And then a little, what is this? I don't know what this is. Just a little, I guess a little paper thingy or whatever. With just like his name and whatever. Keeps your head high. Keep your head high and your kicks fly. Don't stress, just chill. Prince B. He looks like he's a cool dude. Okay. Oh, here's the other clip right here. Or is this the same one? That's the same one. Anyway, I think there's another clip and it fell on the floor. All right, so here are his packages. He's got one, two, three, four. He does not have a box because he is already wearing his shoes. Let's check out the little packages. There goes the yellow and black. We have his sunglasses which look really cool and you can kind of see through it so it's not that dark look we have his uh, uh, oh there's little bees on it the, the packaging for his clothing and this is super cute hold on a second oh look at that his little oh my god I love this I've seen unboxings of him, a couple of them, but I didn't know that. Maybe I didn't pay attention, but I'm loving this top. I didn't know he had something short sleeve, so that's cool. Being that it's summertime, he doesn't have to keep that jacket on the whole time. It's like a grayish color. It's Velcro in the back. A little pocket here. Let's see if that's a real pocket. Yes, it's a real pocket. Well, the threading, and it has a like little loose threads there, but it's still cute. A little gold thread, a hood. Oh my God, that's so cool. Happy to have that. And then here is his gold necklace. Double chain. That's really cute. And last of the surprises is, what is this? A watch. Oh my God, a gold watch. That's too cool. Cool. Very cute. Nice. Alrighty then. And then here is the man himself. It's Prince B. I'm loving the way his hair feels. Look at that. It's a pretty gold brown color with a nice blonde stripe in the top. I love that. Y'all know how much I love dolls with lighter hair. I'm loving the flocking in the back. Really pretty. I, was, I didn't know if it was flock, flock, going to be flocking or, or like paint. Okay, guys, so back to, I had to kind of delete some stuff off my phone because I ran out of space, so I'm back. So, um, here he is. Okay, so let's look at the hair because it is super freaking cute. I love the, like, wavy, natural texture. Oh, my God, look at that. I love the way this feels here at the top. Let's take a look at his rooting, shall we? That's scalp. As you know, we all get curious about that. Wow, look at that head. Oh my god. <laughs> so 
in case y'all wanted to maybe take his hair down and flatten it down some kind of way like that you might not want to do that but you know y'all customizers can figure that out i'm going to leave it just the way it is because i absolutely love it the way it is the gold specks in this hair is so awesome oh my god so super cute there goes the brown eyes his lips are a little big but y'all know how lol do, does so yeah i think they could have made the lips a tad bit smaller um but yeah it's still cute and as i said the flocking i'm loving is kind of like a two-toned as you see here whoa okay I'm trying to get the camera and that's okay there we go camera gets blurry and two-tone or three-tone flocking which i love nice and soft and it has like the shave sides in there like that y'all know a whole late 80s early 90s look you know it's all about that so that's cute as i said there goes the ear holes so no earrings i don't know why they didn't come with any but you know they do that here is the outfit look at the tims okay really cute really really cute the pants are really nice let's see what kind of material this is i don't know what you can call this material it's soft or something so there we go and the jackets it says LOL OMG, black and gold. This is a rubber band. Let's check out the back. It says OMG, of course. Very cute. And has like the fake buttons on there. It's like a thin material. And what is this buckle thing? I was wondering about that. Let's take these hands off, shall we? So we can change his clothes. Yes, and they pop right off. Y'all know with the OMGs, uh, in case you don't know. They pop off so you can dress them better. I'm so happy to get my first uh, OMG boy. The only other, um, I have a Rainbow High Finn um, Rosado. I'm very, very picky about my dolls, especially the boy dolls. Uh, I never wanted River. I wasn't into the blue thing. I think he was kind of boring. And as I said, Cool Lev, I'm on the fence about... But I think I'm definitely gonna end up getting him eventually. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna like change his hair because I don't like all those crazy colors that was in his hair. So I'm gonna like do some flocking. I'm not really, I don't know how to do like the rerooting and all that, but I'll definitely do some flocking on his hair. So for Finn, I mean uh, for Cool Love. Okay, so I took his hands off. <laughs> I won't, I'm not gonna put it back on yet because I want to show you guys the little thing he has on underneath. He has a lot of layers on. Oh my goodness. I'm not sure what this is supposed to be. I guess a vest. That's very interesting. And it has like a little zipper detail. A little glittery back here. It's like he's about to go on a concert or something. Like he's about to perform all these extra pieces. Now, how do you take this vest thingy off? That, I don't know. Let me see. Okay, I got the vest. It's just like a little buckle and I just pulled it apart like that. So, this is weird, the little vest thingy. But it's a lot of layers. Oh my God. So, there goes the vest. It's cute strange but it's cute and here is the shirt it looks like a button down shirt wow lots of layers he's got going on here it's kind of like kind of like um windbreaker type of material so and velcro's in the back let's see here i love when velcro has like the black lining there like that that's nice that's good. Oh, but it doesn't completely unvelcro. You're going to have to probably pull this over his head. Now, why would they do it like that? Really? Okay, we're not pulling this over that big old head of his. We're going to pull it down over the bottom. I think that's what it's meant to do. Yeah, we'll just pull it down from the legs. Yeah, that's not going over that head. If they wanted to do it that way, they should have just made the Velcro come down completely. But they didn't do that. And he has that typical, you know... Um, omg male body and here is the pants with like the fake drawstring i don't like this and i might cut it off or just try to tie it um but you know and the pants are like an it's elastic waist so there we go i love these pants i think they're super cute so no velcro or anything like that elastic waist oopsie knocked his cyst down over here notice that the Hanger is a bit different than the girl's hanger, which is cool. I like that. 
and I'm loving it's just so loving this top it's like a dark gray and like the string there I'm loving this okay so he is standing I have his shirt on him uh, let's see I try to make him stand without leaning on his sister I love it so I put his um, his gold chain on his glasses his watch he has his hands in his little hoodie pocket he still has his little um, Timberlands on and his sister is already rocking her Tim's as well <laughs> So they look so cool together. Like, I don't know if they're going to make them twins or whatever it is, but they look so cool with their gold brown hair. You know, like they can be like, like a duo, you know, they can be like a rap duo or something like that. Or she's a singer and he's a rapper. Y'all know, y'all know what I'm talking about. So I'm loving it. He looks so cool. I'm not liking this stupid string here because it just kind of sticks out. And I don't know if it would look right if I cut it off. I don't know. If I can just make it stay down like this, that would be great. And the same thing with his uh, drawstring pants. The pants one, I could take that off though. But I don't know if it'll look right if I cut the drawstring off of this. Maybe if I just kind of like tape it down for a few days and then just take it off. And then it'll stay down or something like that. But yeah. But he looks so cute. I'm loving it. You got to be careful with the hair because I had to, um, the hoodie, as they, as you see, they make these big holes in the back. I had to slide it, the, the whole thing over his head and his hair kind of like spread apart like that for a little bit. But you can just put it right back up like that. So I don't know what they did to make his hair stay up. Do I feel product in his hair? I don't know. I don't know how they made his hair like that, whatever it is. I don't really feel any product in his hair, but, um. Either way, his hair is up, and I am loving it. He's so cute. Um, really happy to have him. Yeah. So, that's it for my unboxing. I was about to say cool leather. Cool leather. Prince B. Mr. Prince B. Got him on Amazon. So happy. Yes. There he is. I didn't put him on a stand. I don't think he really needs a stand right now, but he looks cool. Guys, go get him. Our first black male doll from OMG, and it's about time. I was wondering if they're going to do that. Yeah. So they need to do the same for uh, Rainbow High, because uh, Finn Rosado is obviously not black. <laughs> He's Hispanic. So they need to make a black boy now for the Rainbow High dolls. And that would be really, really cool. Guys, thank you so much for watching. Take care, stay sweet, and keep dolling. Bye! Mm-hmm. <laughs>